MRS Fall Meeting is an opportunity for materials scientists at every stage of their career, from undergraduate students to directors of prominent institutes, to gather and learn from each other. Today on MRS TV, we'll be exploring how education plays a role across the entire materials community. Hi, I'm Katrina Jackson, your host for MRS TV. I've been talking with a lot of great people here at the fall meeting, all of them really excited to share their research and everything they've been working on for the conference. Here is some of the content we have in store for you today. We have uh, biology, chemistry, and all the engineering departments represented in the material science and engineering PhD program. So it's a little bit of everything in material science. So we're very happy that, that it's been quite diverse, so then it spans or gives opportunities to a lot of students in different areas of interest. Karen Lozano talks with us about how a new material science PhD program is impacting communities in the Rio Grande Valley. Colloidal crystals made of nanoparticles can take exactly the same forms as atoms can take in, an, in, a, in a regular crystal. Even though the forces are, are at play are very, very, very different, and of course on totally different length scales, time scales, and energy scales. The assembly of colloidal crystals can be pretty similar to the way standard crystals form, according to a theory presented by Sharon Glotzer. As part of our 2024 MRS TV film series, Morgan State University's Center for Research and Education in Microelectronics shares how they're working to create a diverse workforce in the semiconductor industry. You'll find this and more content here in Boston on screens and at select hotels, as well as on the MRS 2024 Fall Meeting website. Plus, you can watch it all on our YouTube playlist hosted by WebSedge. And you can connect with us on social media. Education never stops in the materials research community. You can find all our day three content in the MRS TV playlist somewhere over there. We'll be back for one more episode tomorrow, and until then, enjoy the show.